Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. I'm Lori. I'm sure glad you're here. And if you're returning, thanks so much for being here, guys. This is going to be a quick video. I have spent the day in Utah. I had doctor's appointments there and they were long, very long appointments. And when I got home, I just needed to decompress. And so I played with makeup for a while and I like this look. I like it a lot and you guys will not believe what palette I used to create this really pretty look that I like. My Milani Bold Obsessions palette. You guys know how I struggle with this palette, how I always feel like it really kills my look, but I really like how this one turned out. I think it turned out really pretty. What do you think? I mean, please be honest. If you don't like it, please tell me that because I do struggle with this palette and I feel like this is a pretty look. But maybe I'm just hoping it's a pretty look. So give me your thoughts. Anyways, I wanted to do an update in my pan that palette project pan for this year. I am doing the panning solitaire with the Pantastic Ladies. I did not do this for months. I jumped back in. This will be my last update for this project before the finale at the end of the year. So who knows where that finale is going to bring us to. But as for right now, let me show you my update on my single eyeshadow. And yes, I am still on my single eyeshadow. And this is it right here. This is Fresh by ABH. When I brought it in, I want to say there was a dip, but I could be wrong. There might not have been. Not a dip, but there might have been pan. I It's been how many months now? 11 months since I brought it in, so I can't really remember. But I will put a picture up here of what it looked like. And because I didn't use this for months, you know, I'm slowly getting there. I have thought about repressing it, but I'm really afraid to repress it in that it will just take longer for me. I don't know why I feel that way, but I do. So I'm just continuing to work it in a circular motion. I thought I was going to hit side pan today, but I did not. It's still pretty even throughout. So hopefully by the end of the year, this will be done. If not, you know, <laughs> I don't know what else to say. I think if I had not stopped using it mid-year, I think I know this would have been done by now, but, but because I did, I, I still have eyeshadow left to use. So crossing fingers, this will be done by the end of the year, but we won't know that until the finale. And who knows, at the finale, maybe I will have a duo in here or a pan on a duo or it completed. That I know won't happen. You know, maybe, maybe some progress will happen on a duo if, if I finish this single. Dag nabbit, I never expected it to last this long. That is for darn sure. So that is it for my update on my Pan That Palette for this year. I can't believe this year is almost over. I am so grateful. This has been the longest year, but the fastest year. So I'm really, I'm really glad 2020 is closing rather soon. That doesn't give me much time to make much progress on this project. Oh, well. So that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this very fast, furious, and... somewhat convoluted <laughs> update. Please take good care, be safe, be smart, and I will talk to you on the next one. Bye!